Today you will watch the third episode of the falls that happened during this motocross season. First, I'm going to ask you to subscribe to the channel and click in like. Welcome to Motocross. During qualifying at Ironman in the video made by Matt Burkeen, he filmed this crash at the start. There were also these scary crashes in qualifying. And in Moto1. At the first turn, Dylan Ferrandis went down hard after being hit by another oh, rider. Oh! Big pileup! Is that Ferrandis? Yeah, Ferrandis. Oh, that was big. He went flipping. Back Marcus to deal with this. Whoa! Oh, Kai a Wolf. You know what? I think his bike hit him in the. Watch the back end here and watch. Watch this. Oh, I'll tell you what. Bike very, very did nearly hit him in the back of the head there. At the Super Motocross in Charlotte. During practice, there were several crashes, three riders falling during a practice start. Jason Anderson in the sand session lost the front and hit the ground hard and was out of the round. Barcia was also out after hitting a tough block. So much talk. What would happen when everyone returns to racing and understands this format? For the second year, it's time to race SMX. Jalik Swole down off the start of the left side. In 250, Moto1, wow. Jalik Swole crashed and the race was oh, red, red flagged. Flag. But he was attended to and nothing serious yeah, happened to him. Over, but fortunately, we do see he is awake and alert, taking a ride with the Alpine Stars medics after a crash off the start. Well, oh, he's, he's, on, on the he's on the inside. It's a bad jump, and he just gets squeezed out right here. Inside, Super up, easy inside, to do. It's, oh, and he runs it in on Hampshire. It, it's on now. It's on. And, and it's off cambered in that sand right there. Here's this quad that he was doing. Yeah. Hampshire oh, crashed hard in Moto 1 in Charlotte and narrowly missed hitting the wall. Yeah. He oh, got up and returned to the race. The pressure from Hayden Deegan coming. I know that was tough on our Casey Cochran crashed in the same session as Hampshire during qualifying. Uh, that's all that matters. Look at this battle right now, Vial and oh, Vial and Hampshire going at it. Nate Thrasher, who is coming now back going from to Texas in Super week, Motocross in Moto so One Rider. Race, Nate crashed hard week. and had to abandon and the race. Masterpool yes. crashed in the same place oh, as Nate, Jason but he still managed to get back into the race. In the Super Mini, there was this bowling, but none of them got hurt. Oh. Yeah, it looks like another rider, number seven, gets in there. But yeah, the 30 version Jordan Smith's been riding well here in the playoffs, but he gets tangled up. There's a 31 on the inside. Yeah, uh, just ran out of real estate. I mean, that was Hayden leaning in on all these guys. Which he needs up to it do wasn't an easy day for Masterpool. He went off the track and tried to start. jump over a tough block and hit the wheel on a rock oh. and fell. He oh, came God, back Master and almost hit another rock. The track and down. How did that happen? Yeah, well, I, there's some holes in there. And what Ty did, he didn't see that hole once he went off that racetrack. And he walked that tightrope on the inside and get Hampshire. No, and they are starting to catch Kitchen. Oh, no. Hampshire's down oh. hard. Oh, man. In Moto2, in the battle for and the podium, Hampshire and Viali. Hampshire hit a tough block and fell hard to the ground. Kind of similar to what we saw last week. Based on what we saw in the first moto. Now, we take it to another level. The final race from Texas. Dylan Ferrandez fighting for the progressive hole shot. He's got Plessinger. Oh, and a pile up. In moto two of the 450, this happened. Several riders fell and two bikes got stuck on top of each other. In Brazil, in the Max 4, this rider missed the jump. Five second borders turn, all eyes to the, the right hand gates. A good, clean getaway, almost. Here he gets into a tangle with Jeffy Hurlings, I think, down the starts right, and Ruben Fernandez. look. 
Fernandez first and Hurlings, and then over the... Now in Europe, this kind of controversial block has happened. Please leave your opinions in the comments. That was a big hit. Look how far... In the 250, in Turkey, several riders crashed in the first turn. In the 450, a rider hit the ground hard and the riders behind him couldn't dodge in time. He runs into problems there. The two come together. That takes out Guadagnini and Albi Ferrato. Hard hits the box hole shot line for the sixth time this year. Riders down though in the first turn. Now let's go to Las Vegas, where the Super Motocross final took place. The round didn't have too many crashes. In the first 450 moto of the night, Rider Chase Sexton got landed while trying to cross the line. So the he had to pack. abandon the race because he hurt right, his hand. He goes on here, he goes double over this table and single, tries to go to the inside, and that's oh. Dylan. It looks like Justin Barsha. Barsha, yeah. Barsha. Oh, he didn't, he didn't even crash. Chase should have known that on the inside, he's in the middle of the pack. I mean, he's a rider on the inside of him, and yeah, boom. So definitely just racing incident, but that's kind of on Chase at that point. Holding back here as everybody else rushes in. Now in Spain, in the MX2 qualifying then, race, yeah, look, some riders crashed before the whole shot. They're picking teammate as uh, Beniston and the Fantics of Braceras. And then Kai Cosmac is... And we've had these crashes in professional amateur championships around the world that were recorded by people who were near the tracks. That was today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching it to the end. Don't forget to share this video and subscribe to the channel and click like if you're not subscribed.